Good morning and welcome to TransWest Truck Trailer RV. I'm AC and today I get to walk you through one of my favorite coaches. This is a 2022 Newmar Essex. As you can see from outside, it's an elegant coach. Uh, it really is one of my favorites, which is probably part of the reason that I sell quite a few of them. Uh, if I was buying, this would be the coach that I would buy in a big Class A. Uh, so let me walk you through it and kind of talk, you, talk to you why I would buy this. We're going to start outside with this beautiful exterior. Now before you get too excited, this coach is sold. But if you want one, I can always place an order for you on a 2023. So give me a call, shoot me an email or a text. Uh, this is a custom paint job on the outside. So we kept one of their um, basic color schemes, I guess you would say. And then our, my customer chose the, the blue on here. We went through several different versions until we found the right one that he really loved. And uh, I think he did a great job because it looks beautiful. It's nice to actually be out here without any snow. I'm not wearing a coat like usual, I'm not freezing. As you can see, we've got the outdoor refrigerator freezer, which is a must. If you got a coach like this, you're going to be entertaining. You're going to have to have some drinks out here, some waters, especially on a beautiful day like today. All right, this has the power slide trays. And this will go out in both directions. Because this is a sold unit, this actually, these are two ceramic heaters that we throw in as part of our gift bag. And that's just in case you get kicked out, you have to sleep down here in the doghouse, you got a heater down there with you. So you can see that was a smaller tray. This is a full size. Thousand pound carrying capacity on these trays. So you can put a lot of stuff on there, slide it in and out in both directions, makes it really easy to get to all your, all your cargo. So you can see we've got the outdoor entertainment package here. We've got the TV and sound bar. Again, you have this, you're going to be outside under these huge awnings. These are the Nova Girard awnings. Uh, as you can see, we've got the LED lights. Nice thing about these awnings is they angle down. You can see where they kind of angle down to give you more coverage. And we got two full size. So the whole side of the coach is basically going to be a nice hangout area. It's a nice spot to put some tools, oil, those kind of things. Um, we added a tow package on the coach for him. So we've got some parts all in here. I'll show you the tow package on the back. We did the blue ox. So we come around to the back here. I do want to point out some, if you look at the slides, the side of the slides, this is how you know you have a good high end luxury coach. The slides are painted on the sides they're not just black so it looks really classy really good favorite thing about these new mars a couple things you got the comfort drive steering which is awesome and then you got the passive steer tag axle so these are 22 and a half inch alcoas that rear axle will actually turn when you're backing up when you're turning tight it will actually turn 7 to 12 degrees depending on the model makes driving a 45 footer a breeze not as difficult as you might think here is our def tank down here you're going to have a couple emergency suspension uh, valves that's in case you lose air pressure you need to get a tow they can actually run air to these valves and air up your system Back here, we're going to have our chassis batteries and disconnects. Again, because it is a luxury coach, the 
particulate filter that's back down here is actually covered so you don't have to see it every time just makes it again a nice clean look here is your escape door that we will show on the inside that's in the bathroom that's your emergency exit so we get back here to the back you're gonna see we've got our rear camera backup camera We've got our blue ox tow bar here for your tow vehicle. We've got a quick connect airline right here. You're going to have your seven pin connector and kind of hidden back here behind the blue ox. We have our Voyager camera connection in case you're, you're towing a stacker trailer or whatever you're towing. If it's got a camera, you can plug into that. Of course, I can't, I can't show an Essex and not show Big Red back here. 15 liter Cummins. You got 605 horse and you get 1,950 foot pounds of torque, which is a ton of torque, ton of horsepower, plenty to get you through the mountains here in Colorado. If you're wondering what all this piping is here, that's all part of that flux capacitor system that I'm not gonna go into today. You can see it's on a Spartan chassis. So it is an upgraded chassis. We've got our side radiator, which has a lot to do with that horsepower. The side radiator allows you to get the cooling you need for that 605 horsepower. So I showed you the def tank on the other side. This does have fill on both sides. So you can fill, the, or fill up your def on either side. Here we're going to have a sewer hose storage. Don't want to forget to point out we have the window awning package. All the windows have a window awning in case the sun is just kind of beating through at the wrong angle. You can pull out those awnings. They are power awnings. Here in the web bay you're going to see the classy stainless steel back panel you've got your valve shut off here uh, for your water this mana block system so if you have a leak and say the shower the washer uh, dryer area you just shut off the valve to, the, to that section you don't have to cut off the water to the whole coach you can continue doing what you're doing we do have a full house water filtration and a macerator down here with the SantaCon system you got a hot water tap and then you have your water hose on a power cord reel, on a water hose reel. Of course, we got an outdoor hot cold shower. And of course, you gotta have some paper towels out here. To me, everything about the Essex is just classy. Um, I've had people ask me, what, what would you buy? Would you, you know, would you go to the Prevost or the King Air? And although those are really nice, I think it's what suits your style, your preference, and the Essex is something that I really, I really like. You're going to have your generator start up here above the power cord. This is a 50 amp service. You see the LED lighting in there makes it easy to see everything when you're getting in here at night. Here is our Oasis hydronic heating system. That will run your hot water and your, your furnace gives you the keeps your coach warm and now we're to the back end of these power cargo trays Right here are your house batteries. As you can see, we have eight. It's got eight batteries on a slide tray, makes it easy to service. It's time to change them out. Just slide out the tray. Remember, if you have one battery that goes bad, you really want to just change them all out. 
you don't want to do one at a time it's better to go ahead and just do them all all right in here we're going to have our brains of the operation we've got all our fuses we got spare fuses here on the side and of course you have a you get time to clean your windshield get those bugs off we got you covered Right, right here in the front we're going to have our 12.5k Onan diesel generator. Plenty of power to run everything in the coach. If you're out in the middle of nowhere, you're not plugged into shore power, you fire this baby up and you can run everything inside. We also have a hot water tap right here and an airline quick connect down here. Of course, I don't want to forget to show you the wake up your neighbors surprise right here. It's time to leave the RV park. You just kind of give them a, a quick wake up call. As we go around the front here, you see we got the 360 camera view on the SX, so we've got a camera up top in the front. We've got our mobile eye, adaptive cruise control, all our safety features. It does have active braking as well. Beautiful front look, clean and classy. I can't say that enough about the uh, Essex. So the steps, these are hydraulic steps. I've got them shut off so that they're not opening and closing every time I open the door while we do the video. These are set up so they have sensors. If they sense something, if they hit your leg, for example, they would stop um, to keep from damaging anything or hurting anybody. Makes it really nice when you're parked next to curbs or uh, other vehicles. As we walk in here, you'll see we have our nice grab bar keyless entry doorbell that way when they ring the doorbell you can see who it is and uh, answer or not answer or so you can sneak out the back with that escape door here we've got the the interior I've got I want to point out a couple of things let me shut this door We got the gray furniture with the light wood. We actually did a custom uh, order on the flooring as well. We did the King Air floor. So it's a non, non high gloss, just an, a really nice floor. It goes really well with the furniture. Uh, it's not as slick when it gets wet uh, as some of the, the, the um, porcelain tiles can actually get a little slick when they get wet. So theater seats, these are awesome. They're comfortable. Um, you got a nice little spot here to put your magazines, your remote. We've got our cup holders with lights that you can actually change the color. Turn them off. You can pick which color you like. What goes best with your beverage of the day. Um, I do want to lay one of these out to show you. You could actually sleep in one of these. Not that I've ever done it. Super comfortable. Pop up the TV over there. We got our televator. There's our televator coming up. It's a nice spot at the end of the day. Just sit down in your theater seats. Watch a movie, watch the game. Right now we got March Madness going on. I'm interested to see if you guys have any picks, who's gonna win it all. Send me a text, uh, an email, or uh, give me a call. Let me know who you think is gonna win it all. If you get it right, uh, I'll send you a little gift. How about that? All right, we've got our sofa bed here. Nice sound bar up top. 
This is where you would put your receiver if you're setting up a satellite. Again, this is an Essex, so you do have soft closing cabinets and drawers. In the kitchen, as usual, we are going to have our induction cooktop. So you can see we got plenty of counter space up here uh, for meal prep. We've got our induction cooktop that does come out, so you can set it up outside on a day like today. It'd be beautiful to be outside. Cook up some burgers or some salmon, depending on you know what you're in the mood for. Stainless steel sink. You can see it's the wave, kind of the Newmar wave. Once you cover up the induction cooktop, you have a lot more counter space. We've got our convection oven. Check this out, they even give you a little pan to cook on. It's too bad there's not cookies in there. So we can bake some, bake some chocolate chip cookies next time and put them in here for me. Dishwasher, as you can see, it locks. Oh, I didn't wait long enough. It'll lock, then you have to knock twice. Open it back up. It's kind of cool if you want to impress the kids, you can tell them you know magic. And soft closing drawers. And everybody's favorite remote drawer. Don't trick the kids too much because then they won't show you how to use all these remotes. And they take full advantage of every little spot, give you as much storage as they can. Here is your trash can. And also a nice spot here to put your covers for your induction cooktop or your sink. It's a nice little slide tray. You don't have to be reaching way back there to put your stuff up. Nice spot to put your spices. Again, another slide tray. If you're vertically challenged, this can help you. You don't have to be reaching to the back. All right, one thing I want to point out on the dinette. This is actually my favorite dinette option. Uh, some people like the table and chairs. I like the booth dinette. This one has the um, additional power booth. So rather than having to go get the folding chairs from under the bed, everything is right here for you. It's just push of a button. It does come out on both sides. It's really a nice feature to have. Maybe you don't, usually it's maybe just two of you. On the day you have company, you don't have to go pull the chairs out from under the bed. Just slide those out. You got plenty of room for four people to eat. All right, now we've got our refrigerator. So we got a residential fridge. Again, nice classy finish here. Got your ice maker and freezer down here. And then you've got your lock. All right, in the pantry, huge. We got a ton of space in here for all your, all your meals, all your supplies. 
plenty, plenty of room here. All right, now the half bath or your guest bathroom. You got some really nice lighting in here. You got your medicine cabinet, GFI outlet. Plenty of room in here. Now into the master bedroom here. King size bed. We've got overhead storage. Also a G, uh, GFI outlet in there. And then you got your wireless charging pads on each side of the bed and a nice little storage area there as well. TV and sound bar, perfect way again, time to lay down, watch some more March Madness before bed or during bed. <laughs> if you gotta have noise to sleep like I do, you gotta have something on, this would be a perfect spot for that. You got your sound bar. and plenty of drawer space. For all your clothes. I could fit all mine in this one and my wife would have five left. So I think she'd be covered. Again, another spot up here for a receiver. And then you have your panel right here. You can set your floor heat from here. You can check your cameras. You, maybe you're, you hear something, you wanna come in here and check out your different camera angles. See who's out there. Could be one of the neighbors you don't wanna to talk to, you just pretend everybody's sleeping. All right, now in the bathroom back here, we're gonna have dual sinks. Again, really nice lighting on the mirror. And a ton of storage. Again, this is a 45 51 floor plan. You've got two outlets in here. Kind of like how they keep it out of the way. So 45 foot in length. 13 foot 3 inches in height. I always tell folks if you're, you know, you want to have, if you're going to park it indoors, you want 13 and a half, 14 foot would be better, but 13 and a half would work. You got 150 gallons of fuel on this Essex, 105 gallons of fresh water, 80 gallons of gray, and 60 black. You've got your safe in here to keep all your valuables in. And here's that escape door I was telling you about. Again, maybe you have company, you're starting to get on your nerves. You say you have to go to the bathroom and you sneak out the back. Works every time. You take this panel off, the ladder just extends down. Easy as that, you're gone. Uh, shower. Huge shower, plenty of room. We've got the uh, the bench seat there that flips down. You've got the spray wand, and then you have the rain the rain shower up top. This does have the aqua view, uh, which helps you save uh, fresh water. Basically, that light there will help you. It'll let you know when the water's hot so that you can turn it on. You don't have to waste fresh water. Even though you have 105 gallons, that can go pretty quick depending on how many folks you have with you. 
washer dryer of course for those long trips or for those five items that your wife lets you take so she has all the closet all right up front here I just kind of want to go over a few things in the in the front show you these awesome seats it's like having a taking a drive in a lazy boy these have massage on them super comfortable so you can see right here this is your massage the passenger seats extra wide so when you flip the seats around to hang out with the the rest of your company in the living area you've got two additional seats that become part of the living area which is really nice this has the optional uh, co-pilot backseat driver panel there on the side this will allow your I joke about it but it actually comes in handy if you're looking at your mirrors uh, your co-pilot could be looking at the camera and you know let you know what you're about to hit here up front we got these huge screens so you can see your cameras it's got turn signal cameras no excuses. You should be able to see everything as you're driving. You turn, it, uh, you put a turn signal on. It'll show you what's on that side. Down here we have our AC controls, generator start, stop, our docking lights, our overhead fans, the door locks, and then your visors for the front. Here is your steering wheel controls here, so you can adjust your steering wheel. Your pedals down there, you can adjust those as well. Uh, another beautiful thing, awesome thing about the Essex, uh, it's a digital display that shows you a ton of stuff. I'm not gonna go through everything, but I am gonna show you the air leveling. Right now we're in travel mode. This has air leveling and it has hydraulic jacks to level with, so you know, you kind of choose what fits you best for your your spot that you're in if you're in muddy conditions you don't want to put those jacks down you would just level with air makes it really nice you can also do a low low height so if maybe you're getting into your parking area your shop and you need a little more clearance you can drop it down a little as you're as you're going in, into the shop and once you get inside you can lift it up again comes in really handy we've got our Allison transmission push button transmission right here everything else is going to be on your steering wheel we got an integrated uh, brake controller, trailer brake controller. We've got our air horn right here. This is how you wake up your neighbors, or how we wake up the cameraman. There we go. Our producer in the tra in the van over there is going to be liking it. I'm gonna shut off the generator. Uh, we've got our high beams here. We've got our mirror controls. They are heated. So you can turn the heat on here. Luckily, I think we're almost past that time of year. It's time to start playing some golf. Uh, let's see, what else? I think that pretty much covers it. You've got a wireless charging pad up here. Again, Essex, this is definitely my favorite. Um, I just like the feel of the Essex. Um, I love everything about it. The quality of the leather. Uh, when you're sitting down, you can just tell when something's high quality. I uh, just nice and soft, comfortable. Take a nap in here. So now that I'm about done, I'd like to show you one more thing. And that is theater mode. So when it's time to relax, time to watch a movie, you hit the theater mode, the lights dim, the shades come down, and it's time to kick back and relax. I hope you guys have enjoyed watching this video today. Thank you guys for watching. Give me a call, text, shoot me an email if you have any questions on this or any other. Si hablo español, me pueden hablar al 720-276-4241. Thank you guys and we'll see you next week.